What is going on, my people, man? We are back here with another video, man. Today, we'll be talking about Anthem, man. Recently, I wasn't going to make this video or the Crackdown video, but I probably will make this later on today, possibly. It is currently 1 a.m. in the morning, and I have class in about seven hours, but I don't care. For some reason, a lot of people have been bashing this game on YouTube. When I get on my phone or I get on my computer, all the recommended videos are just bashing Anthem, why you should buy Anthem or whatever, which is perfectly understandable. That is their opinion, and I want to give my opinion on it, which is complete bullshit, and that's just how I honestly feel. But let's go ahead and get started. So first things first, I had the game since Thursday night, and I didn't actually start playing until Saturday. Like I said, I'm a busy guy. I can't just sit down on my ass 12 hours straight. Anymore, I can't. I just can't. I don't have the time for it anymore. But I do try my best to play some of these games and you guys have my personal opinion about it. Bioware has been messing up lately, especially with Mass, Mass Effect Andromeda, which is the reason why they're in a the doghouse now, which is kind of crazy. Especially EA. Uh, don't even get me started. But as far as the story is concerned, I can't talk about too much about the story. It seems okay. It seems decent. It's better than I thought it was going to be. But I just skip it anyway. I just want to get straight into the action. I don't expect story out of these type of games, especially with looter shooter type of games. So I don't have high hopes for it, but it did at least meet. It's decent, by the way. But as far as the gameplay as concerned, this game is very similar to a Warframe, Destiny, and Dark Void. If you guys have not looked up Dark Void or no Dark Void, it's an early game from PS3 and 360. Back around 2010, 2009, if I'm correct. And it's just like this, flying and all this stuff. So if you guys haven't already looked that up. But as far as the gameplay is concerned, I love looter shooter type games. Destiny, Warframe, Borderlands. I love games. So this is fits right into my repertoire, this and platforming games. And when I see people bash this game, that how is, is dead on arrival and all that type of stuff. No, that is not the case. I am still in the early stages of the game. This is a co-op game. Play with your friends and then make it 10 times better. I was playing earlier today by myself and I still had a blast and that's actually rare for me to do. Um, are the missions repetitive? Yes, it is. It, it, every game is repetitive. But when you see that gear and you start leveling up and stuff like that, it makes you feel so much better. And are they going to update the game? Yes, they are going to update the game, but we have to take the time. Like I said, for a lot of people, especially look at a lot of these content creators, they sit on their ass 18, 24 hours straight and play these games, of course you're going to be bored. Of course you're going to complete everything because you have the time. And that's what, uh, you know, is crazy to me when you see that, especially with Crackdown 3. Yeah, it was be Catfish. Yeah, we all thought it was going to be something, but it was actually something different. I would buy this game at $60. That's just honestly how I feel. I, I recommend this game. This is a 7 out of 10. I do expect this game to be on sale in a couple of weeks, in my honest opinion. Is the game a buggy mess? Is the loading screen still a fucking problem? Yes, it is. There's no doubt in my mind. The loading screen is a killer. I have been bugged out multiple times, like maybe twice, but it's still very playable, still uh, very durable. I love the classes. I love the weapons. I love the... Per like I said, this game fits into me. This all comes down to personal preference. If you do not looter shoot a game, like looter shooter type games, this is not going to be for you. You don't like flying, stuff like that. The progression system and all that stuff. I have not yet tried free play. I've been doing straight story and just doing straight from that. I don't think the Legion of Dawn edition is not, it's not worth it at all, 100%. I think that shit is ass, some skins, and you get a legendary weapon, and that rifle is fucking ass. So, no. I don't think you get the Legion of Dawn edition. Should you get the uh, base game? Yes, I think you should. Re I honestly recommend it. Uh, the Division 2 comes out, I believe, next week. If I am correct, I will be getting that as well. And is it possible that I will face the same uh, fate? Yes, I do believe. But I think Division will probably have a little bit more. I think they learned from their mistakes from the first one. Another thing that actually bothers me about this game, I can actually agree. I uh, Let me get something straight out the way. Uh, straight, get something out the way. I agree with every single YouTuber with their, their opinion. I, I do. EA is not slick. Bioware, they, they're trying to focus on Apex Legends. But... This game is not as bad as what people are making it seem. It is, in, I can play this game. I have not yet gotten bored. I, I have, I'm at level 12, I believe. So I have been playing this game for a while. It is completely fun. But what actually bothers me the most is the simple fact that there is no PvP. I understand PvE, but there's no PvP in the game. By the way, if you are watching, which I probably doubt, you have to add PV, PvP in the game eventually in the future. Raids. If you don't come out with no new content in the next week or two or possibly three, your game is really going to die out. I'm pretty sure. There's a lot more games coming out this year that are that can easily take your spot. This was one of the most anticipated games of 2019. But overall, guys, if you this is I see a lot I see stuff in the comments. Oh, I'm glad I seen this review and video. Hey, I don't want to buy this game anymore. No, 
That should not be the case. It all comes down to personal preference. This is not a bad game. But I hope you guys have a blessed day, man. I should be coming out with a crackdown video very similar to this one. Because a lot of people have been bashing that game as well. And I do not know why I enjoy games like that. So, hope you guys have a blessed day. See you later. I'm out. Peace.